Good morning, and welcome to the Underwood Baptist Church Morning Devotional for Wednesday, January 4th. You know, last week we talked about wrapping up the year and ending well, making sure that we're not tripped up right at the end of a thing. This morning, I want to think about the other side. I want to think about the beginning. Our verse this morning comes from Proverbs chapter 20, verse 21. An inheritance may be gotten hastily at the beginning, but the end thereof shall not be blessed. A poor beginning usually pretends a bad ending. Yes, there are opportunities to correct things as you go, and perhaps you can salvage something at the end, fix it, and get something good along the way. But if you start out on the wrong foot, you're probably headed for a fall. Think about it in terms of a house or a building. The first thing you put down is the foundation. That's the start, the first piece you put in place. And it sets the stage for everything else. It supports everything else. If the foundation's faulty, if it's not level, if it doesn't have the right supports, or if it's not made of the right materials, or it's not the right quality, or it's just not done correctly, it's not square, even though things may look okay initially, even though it may look like the building's standing for a while, eventually it's going to start to fall. This verse reminds us that if we choose to take the easy or the hasty way at the beginning, what looks like it's easy to get started, just jump right in without planning, it's not going to turn out well. It might seem easy to take a shortcut or to take the easy route, but in reality, the things that you don't earn, the things that you don't work for, the things that you don't plan and prepare for can fade away just as quickly as they came and can wind up ruining us. As you start 2023, that should be our goal, to ask God to show us where and how we need to prepare, to show us how to start our year properly, to show us how we can position ourselves to be where he wants us to be, and to be ready to do what he wants us to do when he gives us the opportunity to do it. And just like we talked last week about the application of ending well, applying to stages of life, years, months, weeks, days, tasks, whatever, all those levels, this verse applies at those same levels too. And everything we do, we need to start with a foundation, a good foundation. To have a good foundation, it must be based on the Word of God, must be based on the will of God, must be based on faith in Him. And that will set us up for success in everything that we do for God. So today, tomorrow, and every day this year, take time to start your day with God. Prepare with Him and position yourself to have the day, week, month, and year blessed by Him. Let's pray. Father in heaven, we thank you that you are there for us. We thank you that as we do start this year, you'll help us to prepare. You'll help us get off on the right foot. You'll help us start in the way you want us to, that so we can do the things you want us to do throughout the year, Father. We ask you just to help every one of us to listen, to seek your will, to seek your guidance, to seek your help, to help us get started right, to help us get started in a way that you want us to go. And we'll thank you and praise you for it in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you for your time this morning. I hope this was a blessing. Please come back tomorrow for Brother Evan's devotion, and I'll be back next week. Goodbye.